Now that it's analyzed and rendered, without any extra adjustment, we can see what SmoothCam can do. Although the image is enlarged, it is able to keep things steady by re-angling and retilting frame by frame to compensate for shaking in any direction. Then, under Filters in the Viewer, you can adjust how SmoothCam counteracts. Auto Scale allows you to reduce or increase the zoom that SmoothCam applies, but be aware that black borders appear the more that you reduce the zoom. Then you can adjust how much SmoothCam compensates for the three main variables translation, rotation, and scale smoothing. Using these adjustments will help you reduce zoom while providing the smoothness you desire. However, SmoothCam does not counteract all elements of a shaky image. Slower frame rates and shutter speeds cause visual drag or smearing when too much movement occurs too quickly. SmoothCam cannot fix smearing. So the best way to avoid it is to shoot footage at 60 frames per second or with a fast shutter speed to reduce the likelihood of smearing.